Hello and welcome to the Southwest Regional Mock March Uh, a, uh, a by x and b by pi on 3 so when we do that we are going to end up with what you see here cos x cos pi on 3 minus sine x sine pi on 3 we just replace as i said now in the the other identity before we go there we need to simplify this a bit pi on 3 
we see in the in the inner uh, brackets we can have cosine square of x plus cosine square of x giving us two cosine of square of x then the sine part three sine square of x have gives us 1.5 that is 3 on 2 now we write that down and we see that 3 by 2 is a common factor so we factor out that we end up with 3 by 2 into cosine square x plus sine square x now from the Pythagorean uh, identity we know that cosine square x plus sine square x is equals to 1 so we replace that with 1 and now 1 times anything is that same thing so we end up with 3 by 2 as required so that was what you had to do to get 4 marks for the first part now um, moving on to the B part of the problem they have to find the general solution of the trigonometric equation this all of this what we are proven to be 3 by 2 equals to 3 sine of x 3 max so let's do that and
the numbers can be arranged. So we have to exclude that. Now, before we do the subtraction, we need to look for the number of ways um, of arranging these numbers without the zero included. So, if we do it without the zero included, it means we are forming a six-digit number, right? So we have so the number of ways of uh, the number of six-digit numbers that can be formed, excluding zero from the list. Normally, when we do that, we end up with a six digit number, right? So that will, that will give me six factorial. So when it's two zero, we are left now with items. And exactly, we still have the three uh, twos and also the four twos. I mean, the two fours. So that's why we end up with 60. This is the total number of six digit numbers that can be formed when the first digit becomes a zero that's why we have to exclude it from the list with this now in mind we just need to do a simple subtraction the total number of numbers that can, that are greater than 1 million will just be 420 minus 60 giving us 360 such numbers thank you guys for watching we have all we are always come to the end of this video presentation please uh, if you are not subscribed please go and subscribe this is not it will not eat your data this is just an encouragement for me to continue creating content and also you cannot even get notification from my posts if you are not subscribed so when you subscribe make sure you turn a toggle on the notification icon so that when i upload the, the next episode you'll be the first person to be notified and also please if you enjoyed this video share it to your friends share it to many your family members share it to your students if you are a teacher please share it to them so that the video can go viral also promoting my work on youtube thanks you see you guys in my next episode bye bye love you all